Okay, we have been talking about fractions lately. Fractions. Ryan, please turn around. Face forward. Thank you. Whole numbers is the whole piece of pie. We've been cutting those pies, those circles, those rectangles. Right? Whole is the whole piece of pie. Or seven. Okay. I think doesn't want to give up. Go up. Let's go to the screen and try it. There we go. Okay, so if if I had a sandwich and I cut it into two, two halves, one two, or one whole sandwich. Here's my pie, yummy pie. We have six pieces. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I have the whole pie. Christopher hasn't eaten any yet. So how many pieces do I have? Six. Out of how many total? Six. So that means it is the? Whole pie. Very good. Pizza, pizza. Who likes pizza? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Very good. Okay, this one has pepperoni on it. And it's cut into how many slices? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, has Brooklyn eaten any yet? No. No, so that means we have the what pie? Whole, whole pizza, pizza pie. pie. Eight out of eight pieces. Very good. This will be here. Okay, what will we learn today? We are going to identify the model unit fractions as equal parts. Equals means they are the same. The same, excellent. Of a whole or set of numbers. We're going to read and write fractions with numbers and words, and we are going to discuss and exchange ideas about math as part of our learning here. Here's some fractions. Here we is there a hole up there? No. There's not a hole up there. Is there a three-fourths up there? Yeah. Yeah. No. Uh, no. No. Three yes. of them colored out of four pieces. Yes. 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 No. 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 Wait, huh? Four of them. My turn. Yes. Please. Yes. Or no. Show me what is your answer. Is there a three-fourths up there? Yes. Or no. The answer, very good, is no. This one, how many pieces do we have? One, one two, three, four, five, six, seven. How many are colored? One, two, three, four. four. Hmm, so I have four out of seven colored. That doesn't equal three fourths, does it? Uh -uh. What about this one, how many pieces? One, one two, three. How many are yeah. colored? One. So that means what is on top? One. one. Very good. How many is on bottom? Three. Three. So one third is colored. What about this one? One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. How many is colored? One, two. two. So what is on top? Two. Two is on top. What's on the bottom? Six. Six, six is on the bottom. So do any of those equal three-fourths? No. No three-fourths. But we have lots of different representations of our fractions that we're going to talk about today. Those are all different ways that we can look at fractions, and we're going to see a couple more ways that we can look at fractions. Okay? So let's talk about the fractions, the parts of the fraction. Okay, there are two parts of the fraction. There's the top number and then there's the bottom number, okay? Top number in this one, we're looking at this box over here. The top number is? Three. Very good. We have one, two, three <laughs> parts shaded yellow. How many parts total do we have? Four. Four parts. One, two, three, four, four parts total, okay? They have special names for them. The very top number is called the numerator, right here. Numerator, can everybody say that with me? Numerator. Very good, and that is where, the top or the bottom? Top. The top part of it, very good. Okay, turn to your partner and tell them the numerator's on the top. The numerator's on the top. Okay, just all the people that are together. 
Okay, back to knee in three and two. Power position in one. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Now, we know the top name. What's the top name? Numerator. That bottom number also has a name, special name, and it is called the denominator. The denominator. Excellent reading. That's a big word. The denominator is the number that is on the bottom. And it says over here. That, that little star. It doesn't want to go down anymore. Okay, down here it says, having trouble remembering which is which? Numerator, denominator, numerator, denominator. Which one is which? Try remembering that the denominator goes down. Can you say that with me? The denominator goes down. Ready? One more time. I didn't say everybody with me. Ready? The denominator goes down. Okay, turn your partner real fast. Tell them that. The denominator goes Denominator goes down. Right? 
right? All right, let's check this one. What is that little ball? I think that okay. little. We're speaking out. Thank you very much for not. All right. Now, we need to figure out which goes with which. And we will drag them around and put them in the right place there. Okay. So we need to look at the whole pie, the whole piece of pie. We know that the whole piece of pie, how it's cut, goes on the what? The bottom. The bottom. The number shaded goes on the top. Top. Very good. Okay. How many pieces do we have there? How many pieces do we have there? Show them to me, please. Show me. Counting one, two, three. You should have a three right by your heart. Excellent job. Okay, how many is shaded? Show me. Show me. Excellent, very good. Brooklyn, can you please bring the one third over to the correct circle? Very good. Is she correct? Yes. yes. Thumbs up when she's correct. Okay, let's count the next one. Everyone together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Show me how many there is, please. How many was there? How many? Show me. Show me, please. Ten. Thank you. There was ten. Okay. How many? Are shaded, show me. How many are shaded? The answer is seven. I can see right here three are not shaded. Ten minus three is seven. Seven. Excellent. Um, Tanner, could you please find the correct fraction for us? Awesome. All right, are we ready to count those spots again? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, how many total pieces do we have? Total pieces. Oh, I love to see all those eights in the air. Eights, very good. Now show me top or bottom. Where does that eight go? On the top or the bottom. Wave your hand where it should go. Top or bottom. That eight should go on the bottom. I love all those little ones. Very good. All right, now, how many is shaded in red? How many is shaded in red? Show me. Oh, you guys are so brilliant. Five. Five are shaded in yes. red. Miss Anderton, would you please come show me the correct fraction? Is she right? Yeah. yeah. Give her a thumbs up. Good job. All right. Ready to count? Ready? One, One two, three, four, five, six. Show me how many's on the top. How many's on the top? Show me. Oh, I tricked you. That was a trick question because we should have figured it out already. How many goes on the bottom? Two. Two goes on top. How many's on the bottom? One. Six. six. Excellent. Two over six. Very good. Summer, show me the answer, please. Oh, can you reach up there? Let's get it over there as far as you can. And I'll help you.
How many more does he need? 